Hello everybody and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays, the very end of an EU4 campaign. Uh, so what we're going to be doing is attacking Ming soon, which I am pretty stoked about. Um, I have considered the option um, of bringing in the other two armies from England to assist in this, but I honestly don't think that's going to be necessary. Um, what I am going to do is I'm going to put these up to all about 50. Because uh, attrition is going to be the biggest thing. It's a lot of jungle. I'm going to try. I'm, I'm mostly going to be trying crawling up the coastline. It's got a lot of forts, a lot of jungles. Like, where is the first? This is the first fort, I think. Yeah, that's the first one I got to hit right there. And it's a jungle. And we're going to go up the coastline. Uh, there are some nice forts in here uh, that we don't have to worry too much about. These guys, so. Disconsent sown by France. Go fuck yourself. Which sure reminds me, covert actions. Sabotage reputation. Justify his fort. Rebels. They got any rebels? Nope, they don't have any rebels. Infiltrate admin. Sabotage reputation. Agitate for liberty. Target must be a subject. Sabotage recruitment. Uh, so discontent. Uh, I think sowing discontent might be a good idea in, in Ming. We need 80. We're almost there. Hmm. Infiltrate admin might be a good idea. It does only last for a few years, though. Oh, fuck. Oh, come on! Are you kidding me? What the hell is wrong with Christmas Island? God damn it. Oh my god, I'm never going to touch Christmas Island ever again. Ever, ever again. I'm never touching Christmas Island ever again. Because all it does is rebel and rebel and rebel and rebel and rebel and rebel. And because it's an island, you can never get troops there quickly enough to prevent that from happening. So now it's Catholic. Fuck Christmas Island. Fuck Christmas Island. Oh, these guys are at war. With Ming and Ava. And Ah. Uh, so, okay, they're at war. You're at war with Ming. Alright, so, there is a war with Ming going. Um, I guess the truce for them, or for Ming or something like that, it uh, pittered out first. So there, there is combat. These two guys are fighting Ming. It's a they got a lot of troops, so they'll have a good they'll have a good show of it. And I'm gonna be fighting Ming too. As soon as uh, my 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 thing's up. There's their big fleet. Oh, I might be I might be able to use this to catch catch their big fleet because I'll be able because it's gonna be out and about. Uh, we're gonna sow discontent. Send that over. So where is my? My big fleet's uh, heading down this way to Christmas fucking island. The other one is. What the hell's the other one? It's right there. So I think I'm gonna have probably one like up here. And then the other one I'll probably try to use to hunt their, their big ass fleet. Didn't I tell them to transport? Fuck, what, where, what's going on? Um, oh my god. God fucking damn it. Get back over here! Ugh! No, I think, like, hanging out right there is going to be a good idea. The Ming fleet is definitely around and about. And about and around. Thank God I got that military tech that increases supply limit. So this is... is it, who started this? Like, let's take a look at this war. The Taoguin... On her imperialist war. So, 
These guys attacked those guys, is what happened. And my fucking fleet is on the other side of the goddamn planet. Well, the time is nigh. I was say, with discontent, I wonder if there's any, uh... Rebels to support, but that would be a while. Take a while to get that. Where is Ming's fleet? I don't even know. The mam- Oh! Well, there you go. A long time ago, like, I was like, the Mamluks have trade power here, and I couldn't figure out where they were. They were in Diego Garcia. So, that, that big-ass Ming fleet... These guys would be set to hunt enemy fleets in the South China Sea. And then we're in the other big one. They're going to be set to hunt enemy fleets in the East China Sea. So I've got all these two huge fleets maneuvering around trying to find the, the Ming's primary fleet. So what we would want to do is do this. Declare war. None of these guys will not join in because of the, the reasons. I still have my truce. They're allied with France. Fuck France. I don't care about the French. I only care about the Ming. It doesn't look like Ming is actually terribly interested in doing it. Oh, you know, they probably can't get over there because of their forts. Fucking three-star general. Three, five, three, three. All right. This is it. I don't have access? Thought because we were allies, we automatically had access. I always forget about that. All right. Trust me, I'm going to be helping you out. Oh. Oh, what is this nonsense? Uh, send our finest gifts to the Duke. 5,000 gold. My god. And is that... Please tell me that's not just farmland. I think it's just farmland. Yeah. I say I really wanted a, uh, a positive there, but... So... Oh, France hit our, our trade fleet. Makes sense. I don't know why the trade fleet is uh, all about getting back out there. I, see, that's the thing I don't understand is why do the trade fleets, when they lose a battle, why don't they go home like they normally do? Why do they always re-engage in combat? Alright, oh, so here's the Ming, the Ming fleet. They hit my trade fleet. So make sure you guys are set, set to sit there. I do have this fleet hunting enemy ships in the South China Sea, so... Alrighty. I'm gonna wait for this one to get up here. Is that mountains? Oh, that's mountains. Uh, yeah. Let's, uh, let's hit it with three. What did they hit? Oh, the French hit that guy again, yeah. Understandable. Uh, did they not pull in their tributary states? Apparently they didn't. Hmm, how does that work? I thought when you attack someone, you pulled all the tributaries went in. That's 154,000 troops on 8 versus 88, and immediately I regret nothing. Come on, you gotta roll better than ones, please. Nine to five, that's pretty good. All right, so they lost 25,000 men. Plus, uh, 39,000 freaking, um... Uh, artillery in that. Mm. Oh, delicious coffee. So who's got a siege pip? 
I got one guy with the siege pip. It's gotta be this one. And then you ha you hang out there, and you hang out there. And then... Breach the walls. Alright, so, and one more time, we're gonna look at our policies to see if there's anything in here that we could use militarily. Discipline, morale of armies, siege ability, ooh, siege ability. National unrest, religious unity, that's a good one. I can, I can knock off this, but let's, let's look through here and see if there's anything else in here that we could really use. Um... Land leader fire. Manpower recovery spill land attrition. Ooh. Yeah, so let's let's bop that off and add on the land attrition one. Well, let's take another look. Yeah. Anything that can get me a bonus on the land. So I take 50% less attrition on the land. That's gonna be a huge help. Admin infiltrated. Okay. Let's see what we can always do to try to speed this up. We can take our arty off. Move it here. Select our arty. Move it there. How much can you... You can stack 40 artillery pieces here total. And you know what? I got... I think two armies should be 40, so we don't need to take that attrition. Nice, 28%. If we can take this some of this stuff quick, like... Oh, fuck, we lost? Our, our, our prime... We, we engaged them and lost. Let's see, hang on, where's my other fleet? Um... Oh, there it is, right there. South China Sea. Uh, select mission. Hunt enemy pirates. Or no, hunt enemy fleets uh, in South China Sea. Oh, that's right. Oh, you know what? That was East China Sea. So you stake to the South China Sea. What do they got left? Nine heavies. So they only got nine heavies left. Man, this guy got wrecked. Uh, we're going to have to rebuild our heavies here. Make sure you cancel your mission. They, they only lost most of our heavies there. So three decker. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, uh, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and then fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine. We're gonna do forty-two new heavies. Suck it. Holy hell, would you look at that. We should probably go over, after this siege, we should probably actually go over there and engage some of those guys. No, so we don't have four, we, we could get one more pip in there by adding in a couple more artillery pieces. Ha ha! So, you guys, right down this way. So, are, they, are any of these sieges? I think some of them are. Yeah. Yeah, so we can get over there and really wreck them up. That's exactly... Uh, that's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna walk over this way. And we're gonna sit... What I'm gonna try to do is hit some of these... I mean... I don't know. Who's going to get it? Because they're sieging down a province they don't own, so I should get it, right? No, I'm going to get a negative two by attacking them there. Mountains. So they pulled most of their troops out of this these regions. 
I'm gonna try to hit this army right up here. Because that's mountain. They, sh they should get the negative two, correct? Right? Yeah, they got it. Okay, good. Here comes the rest of my, my forces. I'm hoping I stack wipe this army. Take the prestige there. I did not. Uh, National unrest minus one? Yeah. I mean, we drove them off, but we didn't stack wipe them. Alright, what was this? Took out a couple Ming heavies. That's good. I'm glad we engaged their fleet. We did knock out, like, most of their heavies. So I'm glad that happened. And we're actually helping these guys kind of de facto in this war a lot. And if you actually notice, our uh, total manpower has not moved that much, which is great. It means that we're kind of keeping it up at a, at a good, good pace. And that army was stack wiped. What? You're gonna navally transport someone to a landlocked province? You want to explain that one to me? Yeah, let's move these troops out and about. Taking some of the border forts would be a really good idea. Like, are they- how are they doing in their war, actually? They're winning, just slightly. We're actually running out of places to convert. Fuck you, Christmas Island. I hate you with a burning passion. Christmas Island can suck it. Alright, so yeah, we are going to... See, we've got 20 there, so we need, need to add in another 20. To make it... to max it out. Oh, you know what we need to do, uh, too? Is make sure we have our, our Siege General on it. Which is... This one. And then we'll pull the other one out. This guy. Move him. So yeah, with the, the with a, a two siege pip general uh, breaching the walls and 40 artillery stacked up on it, the forts aren't that bad. If I could hit him there, oh, that'd be awesome. Because I would get the bonus. I am the Senate. I feel like I identify with Palpatine. Unless, of course, those fuckers, like, breach the walls and shit. It's a shame that these are two separate wars. I really would have preferred to do it together, but, you know, shit happens. Oh, wow, 100 days. We got them. So, uh, next, uh, next thing on the list to do. Here, you move, you move here, you move here, you move there. Took a border fort. Nice. Is the next thing on the list of, uh, on the to-do list is hit those? No, these ones right here. Because they don't have a general. It means I'd be able to really mess them up before they got a chance to. Uh, um, before they get a chance to kind of recoup. Although uh, they did just bring in their reinforcements. Who do you think would win this? I think I would. Oh, so what we're gonna do is move you here, you there, you here, and we're gonna see if, if we can hit them all, get them all in there at approximately the same time. Not that would not be bad. Oh, this is an imperialist war, so um, taking the the capital is the most important thing. Just a long ways away. Oh, perfect. Let's wait for them to to move another province out. And then, uh, I wish I knew if they were locked. Okay, there we go. Go. Everybody go. Dogpile, let's stack wipe some 90,000. Oh, wow. They, that was, uh, that was not fortuitous timing for me. They got the siege. Stack wipe, stack wipe, stack wipe, stack wipe, stack wipe. Stack wipe. Stack wipe. Roll better than a zero. 
God, my rolls are so bad. Didn't stack wipe, but we sure killed a lot of them. What? You know, we can't get past the- we, we have to sit here and siege this fort down now. Man, that was- that was just bad timing right there. Because now we can't get past this area. That really messes up my plans. Alright, so, you two will stay there. At least it'll go quickly. Theoretically. Oh, I don't care if Korea doesn't like me. Ming should probably be out of men by now. Almost! Where's their doom stack? I don't know. So let's make sure we didn't grab the other doom stack. We did not. You guys, right up here. Ah, that was that was the, that we were we we missed that by a few days. But if we get really really lucky, it'll go quick. And I I really hope this war drags on and on and on and on and on. And if we get this one, come on. Good roll, good roll, good roll. Another good roll. Yes! And then we're gonna hit this army. We're gonna get the, uh, the bonus there. Yeah, they got a lot of troops, but we got they got a negative one. And we rolled good. This could be a stack wipe. Oh, they got their troops in there. It could be a stack wipe still. It was a stack wipe. That was... Holy shit. Uh, 50... 70, 78,000 men. That was 78,000 men that uh, just stack wiped out of, out of Ming. So now we're going to move on to Canton, which means grabbing our best general. You move here. You move there. You move there. You, you move there. You move there. What do we got here now? 22 heavies? That's pretty good. Oh, shit. There's their, there's their doom stack. Here, let's uh, bring a, let's get him a leader, a shit leader. Let's get him a really shit leader. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna doom stack the doom stack because I I need these guys to be able to blockade the coastline um, effectively. All right, so one one month to repair whatever damage they have. There we go. And then you are going to go right here. We're going to breach this. We're going to detach uh, the Artie and move him into Canton. You're going to... Oh, can't get, can't get over there? Oh, you can get over there. Nice. Alright. Wait for the uh, the ships to show up and that'll go up a little bit. We got a number of uh, forts, which is great. I mean, they could try to... If they want, they could try to siege down a mountain province. I'll go back there and smash them to bits. Wow, we, we stack-wiped almost 80,000 men. That was I think that was the biggest stack-wipe I've ever done. Water shortage, perfect. Oh. Can't, uh... Can't move all their doom stacks here. Oh, they're gonna attack me. Okay. Good harvest. I'll take the points. They've got a negative one from a crossing. Um. That I actually, I actually lost more men than they did. We won the battle, but I lost more men. Not a big deal. Bring those uh, guns back into the fort. Are they going to sit? Oh, they breached the walls already. I definitely have to turn around and take care of that. Here, let's bring you back up. Come on, some good rolls. We need some good rolls on this. Many interest of this person. 
time resources uh, on his physical world. Walls and gods and then. Oh, they are definitely uh, interested in some in some sieges here. Hello. Did they pull men off of there? No, they still got. Oh man, they're gonna get that real quick. That sucks. Did they uh peace out? They did. That's what happened. They peaced out. Well, that's not good for me. Here, let's finish this siege. Let's finish this siege and hit the uh, the Japanese or the Chinese right here on the coast with everything we got. Come on, you guys, we gotta get some good rolls in here. Uh, man, we are just, we're not doing the, this is exactly what happened last time. Like, we did really good at first, and now we're just not doing the damage. And I really hope we can get there before they take this siege down, because if we do, oh, there we go. Say, so if we do, we're, we're in the, we're, we're golden. Man. That Chinese sending, like, hundreds of thousands of troops, whoa, straight down here. They walked... Uh, they walk through here to get past that force fort, but they still have to go through these ones, which are all which are all star forts. And we're still good on men, and I'm just uh, I'm really bummed out that they pieced out of that war. I was really hoping it would go longer. Come on, stack wipe. Oh, roll better than a zero. Ah! Okay, we stack wiped them. That's good. You guys are seeing these rolls. These, I mean, think about how how much better this would be if we had good rolls. All right, so we just stack wiped like a hundred thousand men. Come on, stack wipe. Come on, stack wipe. Not a stack wipe, but uh, a very heavy casualty battle. Someone coming in here? Uh, what I do need to do is head down this way, though. Leave some of the... Ooh. We're going to hit this fort. This is problematic. They just have so many armies in the field. Hmm. Let's take a look at this, though. Man, they still have men in the field. They still have men in the bank, I mean. Well, they haven't tried to replace those ones yet, so... I'm sitting here, I'm like, what could get me more manpower? Anything? Anything. Gotta take out these armies. So, let's do that. I'm gonna try to hit this one. They, they, they constantly see me coming. That's the thing. From a mile away, they, they always see me coming. Some, got some good rolls on that one. Not not good enough though. I can't I can't hit the I can't take the 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 Chinese blow for blow and and expect to win. Say that a province? That is a province. Didn't even know that. We gotta drive them out of uh out of this region. Is that jungle? That's just farmland. But we'll still hit them. Walls breached. Good thing I sent men down here. There we go. That time I lost more men than them. Please tell me they're going right here. No. Shiza. See, now we're at the position where I'm like, okay, before we were... This is exactly what happened last time. We were stack wiping them, and then we stopped stack wiping them. So what the hell happened there? You know what? My 20,000... uh God damn it! That was that was a huge mistake. My twenty thousand detached uh, 
Look at that. Yeah, that one army got messed up because I had them detached. That was my bad. I lost a lot more troops than necessary because of that. God, and they breached the walls up here already. Fuck you, China. It's just a never-ending, never-ending wave of Chinamen. Province of him under the occupation of Ming. That one they're going to take back really fast. They're rolling so high over there. Oh, man. But we are out of time. Thank you for watching, everybody. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you all.